Hey, welcome to another video review. Make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel. I really would appreciate it. Without further ado, let's go. Dating is such a shit show when you get to my age. It's crazy. I have the worst trouble meeting people that I have things in common with or people that are just, just have their act together at this age. It's just weird. It's weird. I think it's weird when you meet somebody in their 50s or older and they're still trying to run with the party crowd every weekend. I don't get it. I like to go out. I like to go out and have fun. But every weekend, every event, I don't know. It's crazy. Ladies, where do we find decent men that just want to hang out with us and spend time with us and do a couple things and I don't know. I don't get it. Somebody help me. Well, first of all, more than likely you're talking about yourself, but of course you got to make a video and make this disclaimer that all men are like that, or a lot of men are like that. And you, you know, ladies, what, what, what's the problem? Okay. First of all, you pass your prime. Okay. Men that are in their fifties are not looking at you for anything other than recreational use. You could be divorced. That could be an issue, too, that men don't like. And the reason why you don't want a man that's going to be going out and doing things is because you know that if he goes out, he can see more options and he might not have interest in you anymore. He might find a younger version of you. And that's what you're scared about. But I can't stand when these women do these videos and they say, men, not my man, not my experience. Now, there's some videos that you see where women will actually say, this is what happened to me. But the majority of videos that I see, it's all about these women having these personal experience and the experiences and then making this, these videos as if it applies to all men, like all men are doing this. The fact is, lady, you're beyond your prime. There's a younger version of you that pops up every single day. And you're talking about men that are in their 50s, don't have their stuff together. If a man is in his 50s, a lot of men have resources. Now, that's not to say that all do, of course. But the odds are that if a man reaches that point, he has resources. I mean, unless he didn't went through some kind of divorce and his ex-wife then took every damn thing he had. And maybe that's the reason why he has to figure out his life again so you're not thinking about that you're only thinking about yourself but the bottom line like i said is you're past your prime you think you deserve more than what you actually do you probably wasted a whole bunch of time making these videos complaining about men using these filters on your face now i will give you some credit i still can see some wrinkles on your face which is good you know the more natural you can be is good but you still have a lot of makeup on your face, so I can only imagine what you look like without all of that. You're just not the top priority for a lot of men. Men are, A lot of men are just not going to be willing to commit to you or any other woman your age with all that baggage and all that experience. And who knows? You could be divorced. You could have had that already and left that. You could have just been listening to your friend saying, yeah, girl, you'll find something better. Now, I don't know if that's the case or not, but it usually is. And women like you get back in the dating uh, uh, scene, dating market, and you think everything is just going to be golden because you're just such a great person. But what you don't understand is that who you are, you could have the best character in the world, but your age and your experience matters. Also, I've seen a couple more videos from you. And you look like you have your own house, nice house, nice car, all this stuff. You're hella independent. So that means that you're probably bossy. It means that you probably want your way. It's your way or the highway. There is no compromise at all with you. These are things that men look at. So why would a man want to deal with you and commit to you? And especially if you've been single for a long time, because the first thing we think is, what's wrong with you? Why are you single? Now, I can look at you and I can tell that, you you know, 20 years ago, you know, you had some good looks and all that. Not to say that you're ugly or anything now, but, you know, time is undefeated. Mother Nature is undefeated. 
you know, I'm sure you looked a lot different back then, but you don't deserve and you will not get the same attention that you got back in the day. I think a lot of you ladies your age and a lot of ladies in general need to lower your expectations, lower your little checklist just a little bit. And for some, a lot, because you guys live in a delusional world. You have listened to these women tell you that you can still have it all at any age. It doesn't matter. You will find your person. You might find some people, but odds are they're not going to be your person. Why date you as a 55, 60-year-old man when a man can go out there and date someone 30 years younger than you? And you probably complain a lot. Because to me, women that get in these videos and do this, they definitely complain a lot, which is Charlie Brown's mom. Men don't want to hear that. But anyway, guys, you let me know what you think about this video. As always, this is just my opinion, and I really do want to know what you have to think about it uh, in the comments. Make sure to like the video. definitely helps the algorithm here on uh, uh, YouTube. And I'm almost at 5,000 subscribers, so I really do appreciate you guys watching my videos. And with that said, I hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace. May the force be with you.